because you are a very special element of Mancha Elementary and you're going to exercise your right to vote. Before you do that, you need to hear from the three very special people that we have here that are running for the presidential, for the student council. And to take us furthermore into that, we have our counselor, Ms. Miranda, who's just going to guide us today. So let's listen very carefully. Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning! Well, before, before I introduce our candidates, like Ms. Morales said, they're very special students. They're the best, some of the best students that we have here at Mancha. They're amazing students. Before I introduce and I want to I wanna talk to you about today, as you all know, we have been celebrating Impact Week, right? And today, as we continue to take a stance against all forms of bullying, today we wear yellow, and this is to let those around us know that, that we believe that they matter to us. Sometimes we don't let people know how important they are to us. So today by us wearing yellow, we're letting them know that their life matters to us, that they're important to us. And I hope that not just today we let those people know that you, every day you take a moment to let those people around you know that they're important to you, that their life matters. And just like I told you this morning, um, that today's and every day is a very good day to celebrate how special you are. It's the people around you, the people you care about are special, but so are you. And don't wait for others to remind you how wonderful you are. Every day you must look at yourself in the mirror and tell yourself that your life has a purpose, that your story is important, and that your dreams count. Your voice matters. So you were born to make an impact. Always, always remember that. So never forget that your life matters and that your kindness, your generosity, and your honesty have the potential to truly change the world. So I just wanted to let you know that you are amazing and always remember that, okay? Um, now, I know you're here to elect your, or to listen to the speeches for our three very amazing candidates. So let me introduce them to you. Remember, tomorrow you will be casting your vote. Today you're listening to the speeches listen carefully so that you can make the, your best choice tomorrow <laughs> whatever you think is the best thing for you listen to them okay so the first uh, we have three candidates Sofia Castillon if you would please um, stand up and say hi Giovanni Jimenez Good morning, my name is Sofia Castillo. As you all know, I am running for the 2017-2018 Student Council President. I can tell us, as of right now, I will be better, the better choice. Why? You might be asking yourself. Well, because I believe in fairness within the school. I will make sure we all get treat, treated fairly by our peers. I will make time to hear all suggestions to better school as a whole. I have already planned how we as a school can go out and make an impact on our community. I have I thought about what project we can add to our schedule. We can probably add Christmas caroling to the elderly with me as your president. I will dedicate my time to student council at all times and make sure we can add as many projects as we can. I will try and make this year the best for everyone, including our lovely sixth graders. I will make this here for us to remember forever. I will not only keep in touch with student suggestions, but with the suggestions of our amazing staff that works hard for everything to run smoothly. We can add a couple of surprises for our staff. I happen to obtain the characteristics of leadership you're looking for. Honesty, communication, commitment, positive attitude, and many others that make a great leader. Overall, I strongly believe I am your better choice. I will always have an ear for everyone. One of the characteristics of a leader 
Thank you for your time and I hope you have the, you make the right choice. Choose me as your 2017, 2018 student council president. Thank you. So, 
Um, remember, tomorrow you will cast your vote. I hope that you've already listened to the speeches, you know who your candidate is, you know who you're going to vote for. Uh, you will be called to the, to the library tomorrow and you will cast your vote. And that's it for today. Now, before you all leave, thank you so much for listening quietly and intently. Everyone who is wearing yellow, as you go back to class, I need for you to stay behind because we're going to take a picture together. Okay? So teachers, if you would please help me out, I think the students back. Uh, yeah.